pretty pissed at that. She actually was over at a neighbor's house, house yesterday, sort of walking through. So she texted several of our neighbors. Now, look, our neighbors, we've got a number of Republicans who are neighbors, but we also have a number of Democrats. Right. And so, you know, we had folks on our street who put up Beto signs, which I thought was a little... It's a little, uh, a little rude. Um, <laughs> but but, you know, I was, you know, I didn't like hold a victory party in the front yards when we when we won. So, you know, I was, uh, uh, look, obviously, so, it, it's a sign of how ridiculously politicized and nasty and, and just, uh, you know, here's a suggestion. Just don't be assholes. Yeah, like, like, right. like just you know treat each other as human beings have have some degree some modicum of respect one of the things that our audience is keenly interested in is the health and well-being of snowflake is is <laughs> snowflake in fact uh doing well and prospering heat back on I, you know look i i spend too much time on twitter so i've seen <laughs> apparently i i literally fed snowflake to the wolves um and and it uh <sighs> Of all the ridiculous stories, look, I, I love Snowflake. He was home with a dog sitter, and actually the heat and power was back on. And so they, this, this reporter went to our house and took a picture of Snowflake looking out, out the front door, which he does most days. And whoever walks by the, the sidewalk, whatever dog, if a dog comes by, Snowflake will bark. He, every dog, he barks. And the whole thing is just, it, it, it's a little bit absurd I mean, it's a little weird and, I mean, creepy and almost invasive that you have a journalist who spends their time trying to go and take a picture of your dog. I don't know. It seems it, it, really it, it, creepy to me. It is really creepy. Um, even more creepy, frankly, was paparazzi went down to the beach and, and took pictures of Heidi in, in oh. her bikini. Now that is, yeah. And the New York Post ran all these pictures of, of Heidi in her bikini. And I will tell you, that she is pissed about. All the rest of it, she's fine, but she's... Now I'm sitting there. Look, I, Heidi is smoking hot, so I looked at the picture and said, "Man, you you look great." But you know, she's I, yeah. I, I I don't think there are many women that would be thrilled to have reporters following them around, taking pictures of them in their bikinis, and and then sticking them in the pages of the New York Post. Look, I, I haven't had this much negative press coverage since Northern California in the 1960s. <laughs> Man, that I, that took away the question I had about the Zodiac. Thank you so much for getting right to it. <laughs> it, it. It is a strange, strange business I've had. By the way, I've had multiple people out of the campaign trail come up to me and say, are you in fact the Zodiac killer? And, and my sort of standard response is, you know, if I was, I'm not sure you'd want to ask me that question. 